The crypto market recorded a late-minute screamer this week, with the global crypto market cap soaring 11% to a high of $1.82 trillion. Uh, and this impressive growth was majorly triggered by the resurgence of Bitcoin, with all coins such as Solana and Avalanche making unique contributions as well. So Bitcoin is a tempo. Uh, and here's a look again, our top cryptocurrencies. There shows that we carry more work and we could really know the top crypto and they really know what we could do is they could top at conference that are, uh, Bitcoin started last week with signs of an imminent upsurge, uh, instantly breaking the $43,000 resistance point on February 5th. Uh, these signs did not particularly capture investors' attention as BTC signs uh, to research fail professional sides. Uh, beaches. However, industry commentators began observing this momentum when the crypto token breached $43,000 and $44,000 in one fell swoop on February 7, closing the day above the $44,000 mark amid a 2.91% gain. The next day came with its bullishness as BTC transcended the $44,000 level with its eye set on $45,000. The asset achieved this goal of the $45,300 price at $1.55 billion, the close of the day as spot Bitcoin ETFs recorded greater demand. Data confirmed that these products had seen $1.55 billion inflows since inception. And the Bitcoin sustained gains triggered a resurgence of market interest. Trade volume skyrocketed 55% from a low of $16.8 billion on February 5 to $26.2 billion by February 8th. The surge in demand contributed to Bitcoin's strength. Interestingly, trade volume increased again on February 9th, hitting a one-month high of $39.3 billion. Uh, BTC continued breaching more psychological resistance levels until it reclaimed the pivotal $48,000 price. Amid this phenomenal run, the firstborn crypto has recorded six consecutive days of intraday gains uh, and looks poised to seal a seventh day. The last time the asset achieved this feat uh, was last October. Bitcoin now trades at $48,163. It bears mentioning that the token began this week at $42,568 following worrisome market turbulence in the previous week. Bitcoin's current price indicates that the token has surged 13% this week, adding a massive $108.4 billion to its market cap and Bitcoin's recovery campaign expected to catalyze a chain reaction in the broader market. Solana was one of the beneficiaries of this market-wide uptrend, equally witnessing six consecutive days of gains. Sol skyrocketed to a high of $98 on February 5th, but faced massive opposition on the journey to reclaim the $100 mark. The asset eventually gave in to bearish and pressure but retained a meager 0.10% gain that day. Moreover, the second day introduced more substantial bearishness due to network issues. And Solana experienced a network outage on February 6, and resulting in a halt in transactions. This incident, which marked Solana's first outage for the year, led to massive sell-offs as SOL collapsed 4% below the $94 mark the downtime lasted for five hours before network activity resumed fully. Then, and despite this event, Seoul immediately recovered from the price slump, closing the day at $96.85 amid a 1.35% intraday gain. Solana engineered a more substantial rally on February to finally break the $100 psychological threshold. However, its most important breakthrough came up on February 10th when it surmounted the $106 price level. Solana had faced a major roadblock at the pivotal resistance range between $106.44 and $107.20 since its collapse from the December 2023 high. All attempts to breach this range proved futile with the bears mounting enough pressure on January 11th and January 30, despite a substantial uptrend, the latest push helped Solana this breach this price level, which now trades for $109.44. Solana's up 14.6% this week, with a goal to conquer the $110 price level. Avalanche's native token 
AVAX started last week on a bearish note despite a favorable outlook across the broader market. This trend triggered investor angst leading to concerns. The asset recorded mile losses on February 5 and 6, dropping to a four-day low of $33.7. However, an aggressive recovery move saw the token recover the losses of the first two days with a 3.34% gain on February 7th, which led to the reclamation of the $35 psychological price level. AVAX has since continued to record multiple gains, clinching the 41 price on Fed 10 cents and a push to hit the $43.47 yearly high. Avalanche hit 43.47 cents, its highest value this year on January 2002. However, as the market witnessed declining strength in the days that followed, the token's hope of retesting and breaching this level was dashed. With a bullish recovery engulfing the scene, AVAX seeks to reignite this push. The token again surged to the uh, $41 territory on February 11th, but faced another roadblock. AVAX now trades at $40.02, preparing the ground for another push to retest the $41 price. Avalanche would require another round of bullish momentum to set sail toward the $43 resistance.